guys, and welcome to a brand new video. Something a little bit different, a real life video of me driving this absolute beast. Looks so sexy. So, um, I've done this with Shell. I went to the Top Gear track around this massive, massive maze. I had no prior knowledge of what the maze was. I just knew it was a maze, and I had to drive some sort of vehicle around it. That's all I knew, and that's pretty much the whole premise. I had no idea what was going to happen. Um, also, this, this car was actually automatic. The first car in my entire life I've driven automatic, and it was a little bit weird. But it felt good, it's quite relaxing. And this car is, is very good, I like the car a lot. It felt so smooth, felt comfortable to drive. The interior was awesome, it had a little bit of speed in it as well. And yeah, I was very impressed with the car. But anyway, this day was about Shell V-Power Nitro Plus. So this is the fuel I actually use in my car, since it's got my 350Z. And basically it just looks after your engine, keeps it nice and clean, makes it function properly. Um, I didn't actually realize the amount of science that went into fuel. I thought it was just like just a standard like calculation. But apparently like, every fuel is like different and the way it's all put together and stuff. Um, I was very, very impressed. I, I, I didn't realize enough. I learned quite a lot that day about petrol, which is, I know, quite weird. But anyway, um, so yeah, this maze was pretty insane. I had like flames, uh, I had like little ledges and stuff you had to go over, monster trucks, water squirting on me, loads and loads of stuff happening. It was just crazy. Also, the car was not particularly that small. It's, it's, it's quite a beastly car and the maze was like really, really tiny. So I was constantly like shaking and worrying about the fact that I might scratch this wonderful white vehicle. So I was, I was going quite slow, I was quite cautious. Like I said, I was just very, very nervous. And the fact that no one else done any damage to the car, I was just being very, very, very careful. So much like a maze you can turn left or right, I went the wrong way every time. Because I guess every time I went to like a certain like point, it'd say, go left. I was like, okay, I'll follow the signs. And it's all supposed to turn right and sort of ignore the signs. So I turned left, would like, approach like a burning car, I'd have to reverse out of that particular situation in quite a beastly car. But luckily we had like um, rear view cameras so I can look at the back, which is a new thing to me. I was like, wow, this is quite useful. And it's all like, just tells you like what's happening, like where's the nearest wall and stuff. But yeah, like I said, it was a very, very tight spot. Very tight. But anyway, I managed to get through it uh, without any scratches. Like I said before, I'll link the full video in the description below. You should see me pop up a few times. Uh, go check it out. Thank you for watching though. Hope you guys enjoyed it. It's a little bit different. Um, yeah, pretty cool day, I must say. Went to a Top Gear track for the first time ever, where like where Jeremy Clarkson drives with Richard Hammond, James May, around like some crazy maze in a brand new car. Yeah, it's pretty decent. See you guys later. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.